I first met Yeshi Georgie in 1976 in Dharamsala, up in the little village of McLeod Gange, in a kerosene tin shack with a wife and seven children. Uh, he was the shamanistic, exorcising uh, weatherman who used to follow the Dalai Lama as he walked and uh, pointed at the sky and dissolved the clouds and was consulted by people putting the roofs on houses during the monsoons as to whether they were going to be able to get the roof on and uh, exercising spirits out of people that had mental maladies. Uh, he was a Nyingmapa from the oldest school, warned me not to take the Galugpa teachings too seriously down at the library. The Nyingmapas are not monastic and Yeshi Georgi had a wife and some seven kids and his little shack made of kerosene tins. Later I was to find him without his Tibetan wife in the States, a nice uh, younger American wife. We were driving through Santa Fe in 1992 and suddenly noticed on a notice board, uh, noticed that uh, Yeshi Dorji was doing a ceremony in Santa Fe and went out to a beautiful adobe house in the mountains on the periphery and Yeshi Dorji gave a very long complex day-long day puja uh, involving a whole variety of processes including pressing our hands into flour, forming an imprint of our uh, psyche and our wishes for the world and writing notes thinking of anyone that was in uh, hardship or ill or misfortune and writing notes uh, with wishes, good wishes and uh, these are eventually burnt in a bonfire towards the end of the ceremony. Anyway, here you have a short clip of some of the chanting. the end of the day, as it often does in Santa Fe, the desert turns into thunderclouds at sunset, like the tradition of the rain dance is uh, in a way related to, and uh, we had to leave uh, in the middle of torrential downpours, as Yeshi Doji waved his doje or thunderbolt, and not just downpours, but uh, cataclysmic bolts of lightning and thunder. And uh, I had to phone back later in, in the evening and 
as it turned out, uh, just at the end of the day as the ceremony finished, um, we managed also to produce a rainbow, which um, ironically, the emblem of the Santa Fe government is uh, the mountain and the cloud and the rainbow, so uh, like the rain dance, it's um, kind of a feature of the weather in the late afternoon. <laughs>